group of women, their CEOs and senior executives in middle size to larger size organizations and companies. They get together every few months as a support group where they can consult each other on how to conduct their business in a better way. It was interesting was what one of them shared with me two weeks ago about their idea of wearing these jeans and simple t-shirts to the meeting. And I asked, why did you decide to do that? And they said, because we wanted to remove the social pressure of dressing up you know, nicely when the situation and the environment around us, especially economically, is going through really, really tough times. So by wearing jeans and t-shirts, it removes the pressure on all of us and it sig significantly reduces our expenses that we usually do you know, to upgrade our uh, wardrobe and, and, and what we wear. And I found this very interesting because it's an interesting approach to adapt to difficult times. And the reality of life is that sometimes we go through difficult times. Sometimes companies go through difficult times. People go through difficult times. Entire economies, maybe the entire world economy goes through difficult times. And this is hard. It's painful. It's stressful. Why is that? Because it forces us to change the way we live. The only word that comes to mind in this situation is the word adaptation. Because it's really the, re the key to survival. Do we have any other choice but to adapt? Because if you stay on the same level, then what happens? Then you're really denying your reality. And sooner or later, you will be out of tune and you will suffer. So how do you adapt when in, from a self-leadership approach? How do you adapt to difficult and tough economic times as a person, as a company, as an individual? first thing you do is cut unnecessary expenses. Just remove them. So whatever is not really super important, take it out. All the expenses that you do because of social pressure, whatever, you know, the things we do to impress each other and to fit socially, you don't really need to do that in these difficult times. And people would understand. Also, may maybe you should go to generic instead of being stuck in branded things branded clothing, branded whatever. You could get the same quality in generic, in, in following generic consumption. Also by removing clutter of unnecessary things. So making your life simple also reduces the pressure for, you know, that comes from, from financial and economic uh, difficult, hard times. Another approach is to move on the offensive. And that is how do you recreate yourself so that you can adapt to the new reality. And that happens by repackaging your product. You also have to come up with new ideas that can tailor to the new needs of people. My point is, my point is, we have no choice but to adapt until these difficult times are over with the purpose that our eyes on what's coming next, which is going back to prosperity, to better times. So it's just a short term temporary adaptation so that we come out of this in a better shape and we go back to the previous life that we were more comfortable. And maybe even we'll discover that many of the things that we, we have been doing were not really necessary. Bottom line, self-leadership requires adaptation, specifically when you're going through difficult financial and economic times. Music